So welcome back to Heroes Next Door. This is gonna be a vehicle tour. This is gonna be a series of four from East Brandywine. This is their UTV. It is provided to them by the Pennsylvania Task Force, uh, but they were able to outfit it in multiple different ways. The current setup right now is actually set up as a brush truck. So they're gonna go out during the summertime and assist pretty much anybody within the county with any kind of brush related fires or rescues that they need to go through. Take a look, here's what we got. So as we work our way back here, we're going to start talking about the function of this bed. This is a removable bed, so you know when we don't want to work on the brush, we can actually pull this thing out. It's only good in here by snatching straps. We unstrap it and we put the EMS bed back in during the winter time when we don't need brush trucks. But this is a 75 gallon tank. We have three different Indian tanks. These are the bladder kind of Indian tanks, so you don't have to carry those big tanks, so, you know, the old aluminum or brass ones we used to carry. These are the bladder kind Indian tanks. Uh, so you can bring your crew, fill them up with water from the 75 gallons. The pump that we have on this is actually a pull start or electric start. So if you're having problems with the battery, you can pull start it just like any other uh, engine out there. It's made by Honda. It pumps that 75 gallons through two different ways. We can actually do an inch hose. I believe this is carrying close to 50 foot of inch, and but we also have it preset to have it with a reel. This is about a hundred foot reel. You got all your tools to access your hydrants. And as we work around, this is where the tools come in. This actually comes out too. So even if we want to uh, switch out and say, we need to go get someone that's in the woods, we could take this as a brush truck, but this actually comes off and we can put the Stokes back set up there to get that person out. But it's got all the tools you need. It's got your shovels, it's got your rakes, it's got your chainsaws, everything that you need to fight a, a, a brush fire. This is part of the task force. So they're gonna come out, whether you know it's in their territory or not, they may be going up to Elverson and helping with those. As we make our way around here, you notice that it's actually got six seats. A lot of times they're gonna fill up the back with three, maybe two up front, but you can have six people in here. It's got heat, it's got air conditioning. It's fully outfitted with lights and sirens and stuff like that. So if it's close here, we may not have to put it up on a trailer. It does have a trailer. Here at East Brandywine, they actually have two different trailers. They have one that's a covered trailer for the winter time and the, and the bad weather, but they also have an open trailer. It makes it real quick and easy to go. Uh, get it mounted, get it to the call that needs to be. As we make our way back around to the front, you're gonna notice that it's got a winch on it. That winch is very important because of the weight we're pulling and stuff like that, or you need to you know, go down a hill, that winch is gonna be able to get you out of those stuck areas. You know, as I was talking to the guys, I noticed the dents, the dings, and that kind of stuff. You know what, that tells me these guys are working. You know, they're not worried about how pretty it is. They're actually doing the job. So when they're going through the woods, you're gonna hit trees, you're gonna hit brush, and that's what happens. They'll take care of that as time goes along. They'll replace the parts that need to be, whether that's a door that got broken off or something like that. But these guys work this truck, and this is what it's designed to do. Can't figure out any other best way to use a UTV. So thanks a lot for watching this video. If you like it, do me a favor, subscribe, hit that notification button. Check out the next couple of videos coming up. You'll be impressed.